that word from Pastor Hicks. God bless. How many were blessed through that word? Hello, hello, hello to everyone across America and around the world. Welcome to Interlude. Our host, Bishop Designee Lauren Mann, is off on tonight getting ready for official day on tomorrow. I'm Brother Steve Harris with our wonderful co-host, Sister Andretta Lyle. Hello, web audience. We're so glad that you've tuned in. Tell a friend. Let everyone know that you're watching the Church of God in Christ Holy Convocation on Kojic is Live. Tell a friend. Text a friend right now. I want to tell you right now, we want you to prepare in the ministry of giving, but we want to hear from your testimonies. We've got testimonies from email that's unreal. Email us right now at interlude at kojic.org. That's interlude at kojic.org. Our presiding bishop, Love your support, love your prayers, and I'm sure he would love to read some of your emails as well. We want to greet everyone out there around the world in the UK, the people out there in Canada, the ones in Africa, Asia, and from everywhere. The pastors who could not make it even tonight and this week to uh, the convocation here in St. Louis. And also to all our great friends back at home in California. You can text Sunny us in every Southern California. Gotta love it. It's cold down here. It's a little chilly. A little it's chilly. cold down here. We've got a great humongous lineup of guests on tonight. But first of all, I want to talk about this wonderful book written by our First Lady, First Lady May L. Blake. You've got to get your hands on this book. We've got about uh, a few books left available, and you need to get your hands on this book. This book is wonderful, Sister Andrea Delilah. It is wonderful. This is actually the second edition, the second in a series of Class Act titles by our First Lady. And what a lot of people don't know, I got to get a sneak peek of the book while she was working on it. How did you get a sneak peek? I got a sneak peek. <laughs> and one of the things I love about our First Lady that a lot of people don't know is that she is very witty and has a wonderful sense of humor. She has a way of conveying information in a way that is stylish in a way that makes you comfortable hearing it and makes us grow, helps us to grow. So I encourage all of you to get this book, A Class Act Two, because you are a class act and you want to continue to be a class act, get this book by our first lady, Lady May Blake. Now, if you're here at the, at the convocation right now, I need you to immediately go to the West Angeles Church of God in Christ booth, get your copy of this book, and she is signing books this week as well. And there's a wonderful chapter in this book that really blesses me, and you'll love it. There's a section in this book where you ever go somewhere and people are just talking to you, and mm -hmm. they just talking, and it's like blah, blah, blah. blah, you, you're blah. Like, you're like blah, 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 blah. <laughs> and you've like turned them off like about half an hour ago. Uh -huh, uh -huh. That's in this book. You know, learn <laughs> what how to, to do when you're in that do, situation, to how to handle it with grace <laughs> and style and class. A lot of sticky situations, you just don't know what to do. The answer's in this book. But you know, no better person to write a class act from a classy lady as May L. Blake. And you got to make sure you get your hands on this book. Well, you know what? Well, we've got a great lineup, Sister Andrea. Do you have anything else to say to us tonight? Because we have Bernadette Stannis from Good Times with us tonight. Yes, yes, the one and only, the one and, the one only. and only. She is not just an African-American icon, but she is an American icon. Yes, she and is. she's a very classy lady as well. And also, uh, Courtney Vance is with us tonight. Yes, very excited we're about that. Out the, we're pulling out the best of the best on tonight. Saturday night. You Saturday don't want to miss night. it here at the Holy Convocation. So we want to thank a couple people for giving who have gave tonight. You can give right now. There's a donate button right there for you. Right give and heads. donate. We're asking for $10 every night. And you know, if you give $10, whatever you give is such a great blessing but we're going to trust God to believe for a few people at least 20 people who can give $99 if you sow into fertile ground great things will happen to you we're going to trust God for a few people who will step out on faith to say you know what I'm going to join Bishop Charles E. Blake and support missions and education and just give $99 on tonight. And that way, we can be a blessing to the people across the world. There's so many things that coaching charities do that the Church of God Christ provides for people, and it's your help and your support to make all those wonderful things happen. And, you know, there's so many people who are watching right now who weren't able to get in your cars and drive five and six hours to get here, weren't able to get on a plane, book a hotel reservation, but you can still participate. You can still be a part of what's going on here. And part of that participation, even in the worship, is by giving. Giving is a part of our worship. And so we want all of you watching to remember that and participate with us as we give. You didn't have to get on a plane, but you can push that button right above our heads that says donate. And by pushing that button that says donate, you can participate, you can be a part of the worship experience here, and you can support the work going on here in St. Louis. St. Louis has been affected greatly it has been affected by the Holy greatly. Convocation. You know, last year I heard a statistic. Uh, the police department let us know that crime in the downtown area 
actually went down wow. surrounding the wow. week of Holy Convocation. It's the saints doing wonderful things. I'm getting an email right now, and some people said we couldn't be there, but we're enjoying interlude from the comfort of our own home, and we thank God for you. Thank you know you what? So speaking much. about that, don't forget to set your clocks back. Time goes back one hour tonight. One hour. We get one an hour. extra hour of sleep. And an extra hour to pray. An extra hour to pray. All right. Let's hear from our presiding bishop, Bishop Charles E. Blake. We'll be right back with much more interlude live right here from St. Louis, Missouri. Let's hear a best message from our presiding bishop, Bishop Charles Edward Blake. We are grateful. God has given me a great love for Africa and for its people. I feel that African Americans are the Joseph, sold by his brothers into slavery, prospered and endured in the midst of all that he endured and all that he experienced. I feel that God blessed us in the land of our captivity and has brought us even to rule. Our president is an African American. God has blessed us in the United States of America, but unlike Joseph, who realized that God had blessed him, that he might reach back to those very brothers who had sold him into slavery in the first place and help them. Sometimes African Americans are not as aware of their obligation and their responsibility to help and to bless those brothers of theirs in Africa whom they have left behind. The plight of Africa is in many ways very desperate, but God has enriched us and God has prospered us that we might connect to our brothers and sisters, and I really don't feel that we'll be complete until we do what we can to lift the level of our brothers and sisters, not only in Africa, but literally around the world. Missions is the very heart of God, and God blesses us that we might bless others. If God can get it through you, God will give it to you. I want to encourage you with all of my heart to share out of that that God has so lavishly given to you so that others might be blessed, so that individuals, not only Africans, but individuals on every continent of this earth who need to hear the word of God will have an opportunity to do so. I assure you that as you give and enable your denomination to do it, missions will always be high on our list of priorities in terms of all that we do. God bless you as you share and as you give. We thank God for all of you watching us across America and the entire world. We have with us on tonight a great gentleman who is a great leader in the Church of God in Christ, and it's our only very own Superintendent Frank Anton White. And I want to just tell you that congratulations that you will be elevated to the office of bishop on in about 72 hours? 72 hours? So I can call you Superintendent. Hours. For the next 72 hours. You can call me Frank Anthon for life. You're my dear friend. How are Tell you, us, sir? I am so wonderful. Tell us about this wonderful program. And we want to say to all you out there watching, we have a special treat for you coming up. Don't leave. Don't go away. We'll watch your emails come in right now. But also, we want to just say very thank you to uh, Martha in Freeport, Louisiana, who gave. Thank you so much for your gift. Uh, Sister Shirley in Moreno Valley, California. Thank you for your gift. Also, Kevin in Smyrna, Georgia. Thank you so much for your gift. The people are giving along online and around the world. And your son is with us on My tonight. My son is here. Tell us about this great new Kojic initiative. Well, it's a beautiful program, Steve, and that it deals with uh, instant and immediate savings. It's called the Kojic Honors Reward program and I'm happy to not only have my son with me brother white and uh, how are you enjoying the convocation son I'm enjoying the convocation God is good God is blessing this that's is his son. only child. His only child. It. His only he's child. Fabulous, and he's in love. Amen. All right. Oh, now. I told the With whole world. With Jesus, falling in yeah. love. Okay. <laughs> but I want you to understand, we have an exciting new partnership in the Church of God in Christ, and we've went into partnership with the Church of God in Christ and Club Med, and now we have the Kojic Honors Reward Program, and I'm so happy to have the principal and chief executive officer, Brother Jeff. He is here. But Jeff Jasma, Jeffrey Jasma is with us, and he's going to give you some information about how you can become a part of the Kojic Honors Reward Program. Welcome. Thank you, Bishop. Thank you, and congratulations to you. We are humbled to be here today. We are humbled to be here this week. The Kojic Honors Reward Program, and you can see it online at kojicrewards.com. It's a cost of $29.99. 
And what that gives you is instant discounts every day for one year to over 250 companies, prescription drugs at over 60,000 pharmacies, wow. entertainment, hotels, fashion, restaurants. But what's really important, Bishop, is the proceeds of this program go to support Bishop Blake's Urban Initiatives wow. Program. And as we said earlier today, if we can get 5% participation through the congregation, this can raise six or seven million dollars to support the most important thing, urban initiatives. Jeff, let's, let me ask you one more time. You're saying that for $29.99, the membership will have instant access to hundreds of retail partners within your organization. Thousands. Wow. There are already over 100,000 locations that accept the card, 60,000 pharmacies. We have fashion retailers, hotels, automotive. Give me some names, Jeff. Like Certainly. We have brands like CVS, Rite Aid, and Walgreens, 40% discount on prescription medicines. Hyatt Hotels, 15% discounts. Hyatt Hotels. New I can show the Kojic Honors Reward card at a Hyatt Hotel and get 15% off. Across 500 properties around wow. the world. Wow. We have brands like New York & Co, 33% discounts. Wow. We, have, we add five new companies every week. And here's what's really important. This week, right now, if you go to KojicRewards.com and you purchase this membership card, the proceeds go to Urban Initiatives. And what's really important, if you're doing it online, KojicRewards.com, you enter promo code KOJIC, C-O-G-I-C, and for the cost of $29.99, it gives you back a $25 dining card wow. to Restaurant.com, over 18,000 restaurants. So everybody go to KojicRewards.com right now. KojicRewards.com and make sure you enter the special code. Kojic and you're supporting urban initiatives. Kojic Honors Reward, there's no card like it in the market. Thank you. Thank you. For you know, that, that is a great, great, great program. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. We'll see you all soon. All right. Now, we want to remind you, we have a few conventions and conferences coming up. Don't forget that the leadership conference will be taking place coming up in the month of January. We want to make sure that you're there for the leadership conference taking place in January. Official day is tomorrow, live at the Edward Jones Dome, starting at 9 o'clock a.m., and we'll be broadcasting live tomorrow on the Word Network as well. So we want to make sure that you are there for this wonderful, wonderful official day that's going to be taking place coming up real, real soon. And that's in less than 24 hours. Keep our presiding bishop, Bishop Charles E. Blake, in prayer as we make things happen and keep things moving along right away. Also, we want to remind you that the AIM Convention is coming up as well. The AIM Convention is coming up as well in the month of June. AIM Convention takes place in June and it's gonna to go to Birmingham, Alabama in June. In Birmingham, Alabama, we wanna make sure that you are there. Spring Call takes place in Memphis, Tennessee. It's gonna be off the chain and wonderful. And we wanna make sure everyone makes it your business to meet us at Spring Call. Real quick, before we end up our program, you know, it's unbelievable. I just wanna give you the microphone and say, Courtney Vance, television and film is right here with us. He's a member of the Church of God in Christ. Now you come to church, in Los Angeles, you may see him running down the aisles and shouting, Courtney, how you doing, Doc? I'm blessed, thank you. I had a wonderful opportunity to share uh, with the Kojic Charities this, uh, this afternoon. Bishop Blake uh, asked me to come and share, and I spoke about choosing life, and it was, uh, it was, I was blessed by it. Amen, and we have our great friend, Ms. Bernadette Stannis from Good Times is here with us in person. Say hello to everybody out there watching our program. Hi, everybody, how are you doing? You know, and we want to tell you, we want to thank God for you being here tonight. We know that we're praying for you. You just recently lost your mom, and we want to keep lifting you up in prayer. Yes. That God will keep undergirding you and blessing you, but you're still here with us on tonight. Yes, thank you. Yes, I lost my mother to Alzheimer's, which is a very terrible and devastating disease. And I hope to God that God would just put it in someone's mind to, to have a cure for this thing. Because it's very devastating, and there is no cure, and you, you do die from it. 
So you have a new book that's out. You're here signing autographs. You have your new book as well, yes. and you have posters as well that you're signing, and let everyone know that you are here. Amen. Amen. I'm so happy to be here. This is my newest book on finances, Situations 101 Finances, The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. You know, in these times, we got to know some things. And then, this, of course, this is the one that I've, I've always been promoting called Relationships, Situations 101 Relationships, The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. Now, Courtney, have you read my books? No, I haven't. Well, you're just going to have to read these books. You hear me? <laughs> All right, you're going to hey, get man. these two. <laughs> hey, man, Courtney Vance, thank you so much for joining us out there, and we thank God for you, and thank God for all the wonderful things that you're doing, you and your wonderful wife as well. Hey, Amen. Well, she's uh, in New York doing a, a Broadway play, uh, The Mountaintop with Sam Jackson, so um, we're a busy family, and hey, uh, we're just thankful. Hey, Amen. We thank you so very much. I'm Brother Steve, and we got a special announcement. We're going to run for you right now. Thank you all so very much. Don't forget to join us live tomorrow morning right here on the Church of God in Christ National website. On behalf of Lauren Mann, our host, he'll be back tomorrow morning. We thank God for each and every one of you, and God, good evening. God bless, and we're still getting your emails and your calls coming in right now. And let's go to the special message from a special tribute to Shirley Caesar. Until tomorrow, God bless. I'm Brother Steve. I'm Pastor Shirley Caesar. BET and Black Girls Rock are acknowledging me with a special living legend honor. I come to you with a request. Let's make sure that we support the only award show on television that celebrates the brilliance of black women. We're recognizing Tatiana Ali, Pastor Shirley Caesar, Taraji P. Henson, Angela Davis, and more. Celebrating the brilliance of black women. Black girls rock! Black Girls Rock premieres Sunday, November 6th at 8 only on BET. There is still need for 100 volunteers to assist the adjutants on tomorrow. And we're asking that when you come, if you're one of the volunteers, that you would please follow the directives of the adjutants as you enter into the building. Everyone.